Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It is Juventus against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, thanks, Derek. This should be a tight group, so it's vital these teams get off to a good start here. This should be a very competitive game tonight. And the old lady of Italian football going with this starting 11. Wojciech Szczesny between the posts. Danilo starts with Alexandro as fullbacks. Philip Kostic plays with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. team looks like this Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper Marquinhos plays with Sergio Ramos at the back Fabian plays alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room and leading the line Lionel Messi plays alongside Kylian Mbappe it's the opening match day Champions League group stage match day one underway Di Maria Di Maria cutting inside terrific block Fabian committed challenge an exciting talent who has everything a forward needs to be successful. Stuart, what are you expecting to see from Mbappe? Well, Derek, you know he's got the right place when he's running with the ball or running in behind defenders. And that's what makes him such a threat on the counter-attack. And I'm sure that's going to be the tactics today for his team. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Lionel Messi. Hakimi. Won by Alexandro. Plenty of support here. It's Neymar. And fired against the crossbar. Goal kick it'll be. And the flag is up, offside. Well, that's just a lack of awareness. He was clearly in an offside position. Hakimi. Lionel Messi. Must score! Can they slot at home? Well blocked, but he must clear it away. He's given it straight to the opposition. Giving it a try. It's still alive. Not a time for cool heads. Well, you have to think they're going to take the lead at some point. Because they're really looking dangerous at the moment. Must be. And inches away. Didn't miss by very much at all.
Marquinhos. On to Messi. And PSG pushing forward with options available. Must take the lead here. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. to say meat and drink to those in the wall and it could be an opportunity for PSG to take the lead from a corner and over it comes and the danger still on Marquinhos the crossbar got in the way danger averted for now Counter-attacking, very much an option. All hands on deck. Real chance. And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Corner kick played in. And he didn't have too much room to work with, but a long way off target. Mbappe. Minge. Neymar. Sergio Ramos, and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, PSG have controlled the possession over the last 15 minutes. You sense it's inevitable the goal will come. It'll be certainly no less than they deserve. They just need to be a bit more clinical in that final third now. Well, that didn't go exactly to plan. And no wonder he's getting a few icy stares from his teammates. Yeah, that's a complete waste. He was never going to score from there. Di Maria. Juventus, the old lady. They know how to keep the ball. What can they do from here? To jump in front. Squanders the chance for 1-0. Well, that's a big miss. They should be leading now. He's lost possession of the ball. Di Maria, and he might be through here. He's gone and missed that guilt-edged opportunity. Well, sometimes in these 1v1 scenarios, you have too much time to think about it. He should do better for me, though. Verratti. So three minutes of stoppage time coming up. A real opening now. What a big chance that was. Keeper has the ball. Vraovic. And there goes the half-time whistle. That will do it for the first half here in Turin. Kylian Mbappe, such a burgeoning talent, but if he analyzes this performance, and you're going to analyze this performance, is he going to be cross with himself? Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In my view, he's got to make more runs behind this back line in the second. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences.
Messi. Here's Mbappe. Well, tremendous block. Constantly thwarted. And Neymar. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Can they take advantage of the situation? Safe pair of hands did his job. Kylian Mbappe. Verratti. Fabian. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Lionel Messi! That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. Substitution it is for PSG. Now, how about the short corner? Verratti. And the advantage is with PSG. And the ball is loose. Threat over for now, it seems. Fabian. Now Messi, can he give them the advantage? And they could face difficulties here. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? Di Maria. Nuno Menge. Messi. Perfect challenge. And Messi in a good position. What can he and his teammates do? A really vital interception. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Rabio. Strong but fair tackle. Neymar Sanchez and the ball's gone and he's got the beating of his opponent well, defending always has to be a team effort good piece of covering and the counter looks on here options available and it looked like open road for them but up a dead end Can they nudge in front late on here? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Ten minutes left for play. Space afforded him. It needs an accurate cross. Nicely timed tackle. But I think just lost his focus for a second. And a throw-in conceded. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Vlaovic a very effective challenge put in now can they counter clinically attacking possibilities for PSG and in with a real chance Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, but in the end, it's far too easy to break the 2v1 against the keeper. What were the defenders trying to do? Nice finish, but poor defensively. So the ball 
rolling again with the score line standing at 1 0. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Kylian Mbappe. How can they find a late leveler? So full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Yeah, that's a good win and a vital three points. Another win next time out, and they'll be in a great position. Well, Stewart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. Well, he was the best player on the pitch today. His movement, skill and work rate were excellent. And, of course, what a time to come up with a goal.